sign right here. The middle finger up on the bottom is, uh, stands for Elf the Crips. And this other sign with the fingers stands for Crowder Street Bloods. This CK is a Crip killer. Alright, hang on, let me just tuck in all my wires here. Feel like a... Okay. Um, so, the zero tolerance, what, what effect if, is it having at all on the gang? It's really not helping none. You see what I'm saying? It ain't gonna stop nothing. Shit's still gonna happen. You know what I'm saying? It's really making it worse. Why? When they jump out on us and put guns in our face, Make us get on the ground, kick us, take our rags. It don't do nothing but make us aggravated. Yeah. You see what I'm saying? We're going to take our pain out. We're going to go take our pain out on somebody else. Like you know what I'm saying? That's just it. It ain't helping none. If they lock this man up here 15 years flat, what you going to do when you come out, cuz? Still bang. Still be crippin'. Regardless. We get locked up, we crippin'. We out here, we crippin'. This is in our blood till we die. Who for life? It ain't helping none. What if has it had any effect at all on what you do or how you how you lead your lives? Nope. Ain't gonna change it. nothing. I love it. Wouldn't do nothing else I in the world. It. Why? <laughs> I get a kick out of it. I like bang, you know what I'm saying? Blood killer. Well, well what do you avoid certain areas? Has anything changed? Is there a, a drive by stopped or my house? We're finna be our whole shit. We finna turn stop six. It's gonna be our cook. What, have, take them hoes out to your own cook. Uh, has it stopped you know any of the saying? violence at all? I mean, is that good? Hold on. Y'all y'all know better than us. Have you stopped any of the violence on? <laughs> you live here, I figure it. I'm... It's not gonna stop it. Like, I'm, that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's making it worse. Down it's making it worse. Every time they jump out on us, we know we can't do none of them. So we're going to go do something with somebody else. Take it out on somebody See, like, else. We, See, we, we, can't, we can't even walk on our own streets without a law well, jumping out the car yeah. and plain yeah. clothes harassing us yeah. with a gun. Yeah. And then, yeah. 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 they ain't going to do yeah. nothing yeah. but make yeah. us go out and take her out. Yeah. When they take her out, when they take care of their business, we're going to go take her out. Take her out. Just like that. That's yeah. how we yeah. see. Against anybody. Is there anything anybody could do 
to get you out of a gang? No. No. Nope. 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 The only way, nope. the only way nope. we're going to get out nope. this cribbing nope. is when we six feet up. Like I told him, you ain't going to stop. You understand? Crip or die, crip or cry. That's it. That's it. And, and that's some real. That's and this is a survival thing, too. That's some real. Okay, tell me about it. See, we all out here, see, we get together. You know, some of us make money, some of us don't, but we still a family because we look after each other, we take care of each other. Whatever. And see, some people, we all got. We all got. And it's going to stay it's like, like that. Don't care nothing about it. It ain't about no slime, cool. We talk it's about, about us. It's about a family thing. It's about us. And for us all over, it's going to be all us. It's going to be all us for us all over. It ain't going to be no other sets. Ain't going to be no other gangbangers. This is going to be us. It's just going to be us. Stop see, six. No Stay people, outside. You know what I'm saying? Stop six. It's going to be all us. See, my but right there, his brother wasn't in a gang, you know, and he, he got was killed. No shot in the head. Well, you know? what about when you hear that, you know, the little seven-year-old kid got shot or that 15-year-old girl? Did that. You know? They say my brother did that. They got my brother locked. He's at the wrong time. He just got caught in the crossfire. Ain't yeah, nothing no we can do about that. They say if I See was out, out, they say if I was out at the time, they say they would have put it on me because uh, they say just because it's gang banging all up in the paper, talking about it's your brother, it's gang affiliation and all this. Explain to people who might not understand why it is that that you're in the gang and 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 what makes it so that people want to be in the gang. It's some, it's some. You understand me? We don't got nobody. You know what I'm saying? Some of us got families, but we tied it together like this real. You see what I'm saying? This is us here. right here. We love each other. This ain't all of them. It's more of us. This is just a few that came. You see what I'm saying? Okay, I got you. So, and it's not against the law in Texas to be in a gang. I know right. that. So, but, I know it. but where do you take the step where it becomes more than just being in a gang and more than being family and it turns violent? I mean, it, when, when, somebody comes, when, when somebody comes, when somebody comes and disrespect us. Right. You see what I'm saying? I got you. Somebody, you know, miss my brother right here, you know. I gotta be down with him. We gonna die together. That's the way it is. Cause we're a family. We all win. We all it together. Ain't, it ain't about sex no more. It's about a whole family. Together. We, we don't even call it gangs no more. It's a family. Four, three, five, two, three, three. It's a family. One eighty seven gangster family. That's what all we are. It ain't about all that no more. Yeah, that's what them laws. We and, stick together. We ain't together to hurt down. nobody. We that's just what they together. Fail to we together to protect us and our and our places. Southside right now is us. This is us. Not this nobody from Como. Not, not nobody, nobody from Stop Six. Ain't none of that no more. Southside. Southside. Southside, Texas. Nope. And everybody out here grew up on these streets, went to school with each other, and been down for each other with a long, for a long time. Nothing. Ain't and what they doing? What they doing? It's making it worse. It ain't gonna do nothing but get worse. That's all. Cause you know you can't mess with the laws, so you're gonna take it out on somebody else. That's right. And then, too, if we get too aggravated, you know, we lying, you know, we take our business with, with them. them, too. Yeah, so, to trim, trim off with them. is zero tolerance going to stop the violence? No, no. Nah, ain't nothing. Ain't nothing. Ain't, ain't gonna stop me. Ain't nothing but, like, we ain't seen this nothing but a nothing cliche. You know, they, go, they, they can say what they want to say, but they're not gonna stop us. Can't, can't stop they can't, can't stop us. We can't stop them from being policemen. They can lock they us up, but we still, still gonna be Crips. Crips forever. Crips in the Like I said, if I get locked up for 15 years, I'm gonna come out Cripping. I'm a crip in there, and I'm a crip out here. Only thing gonna stop it when I'm dead, and I'm still gonna be cripping. Cause I'm gonna be buried with this here. Still gonna be cripping. We gonna make sure that. We gonna go where we gonna go when we dead. So pump it up down there. Now. It's a C thing, you wouldn't understand. They gonna just change now. Tell me when we got stopped. Well, we just wanna at least hear, you know, what See, you say and how I'm, it happened. I'm gonna tell you what zero tolerance it is. It's harassment. You see, if you get stopped, and you don't have no license, no insurance, they might write you some tickets, they might not. They but they're going to let you go. But if we get stopped, they're going to take us to jail. Going to jail. Uh -huh. Pull down you know our clothes. Saying? They pull our clothes take down in the middle of the street. Guns, take our shoes yeah. out. Make us stand in ass. You see what I'm saying? Take gun out facing the guards. That's what I'm saying. Oops, I'm have you been stopped? I have. Yeah, I have plenty of time. They stopped me in the middle of the street. We got arrested last night just by using the phone. They stopped me in the middle of the street. No, we can't do nothing without getting messed with. They can stop hanging down here. That's yeah. what they trying to do. You see, all that's over with. We stopped Crip chilling for a minute, but we ain't no more. We ain't no more. They can't, they can't run us from here. They can't run us from here no more. They can't run us from here no more. We've been here all our lives. How they gonna try to make us move? This house. You know, our mother and father grew up here, so we wanna grow where our mother and father grew up at. It's Crip for life. You know? 
Chris They come life. down here, y'all can't hang, and you too Look, far from home. This is our home. How are we gonna go somewhere else? We at home Side right here. GC. Where you live, you might live in Las Colinas, but that's your home. You might be around the corner from your house, but that's your home. This is our home. Can't go nowhere. Can't do nothing else. Stay right here from now. Stay right here from now. Ain't no running for no two months. We gonna stay. Ain't no separating each other for two months. We gonna stay here every day. Get our crib on. We gonna stay down right ain't here. Ain't gonna stop till the casket drop. Down, right here. Can't nobody else run off no goddamn. Way. You don't see the you don't see you don't see the government, you understand me, and zero tolerance and all that for the KKK. Right. You don't see that though. You understand so what I'm right. saying? So you don't you don't you don't see that though. They Talk don't mess me. with the KKK like they mess with us. Good they, the protect, they protect the KKK. The they protect the They protect the KKK. They don't protect us. They jump out, put guns on our noses. Well, well have you, you know, tell me this: how many times have you been, been stopped in zero tolerance? Since it started, yeah, yeah. Five, yeah. Times. five times. Five times. Five times. I, I done got jacked. I done got jacked up down here three times. Really? Three times. They stopped us in the middle of the freeway. Made me pull my pants down yeah. in the middle of the freeway. And what happened to you after you were stopped? They took him to jail. They did. Yeah, they, they gave him some jail, tickets right. and took him to jail for the tickets right there on the spot. They won't take him to jail for carrying these blue rags. They can't do that. They, they want to stop that. us from they carrying these. See, I got mine so we, right now. We, we burn. They we sell money too. But they then, sell too, them. if we still didn't want to wear a seat, it's the government doing it. So get so your projects over there. We get to places they put us. How, in. Who's, you've all been stopped at yes. some point in the last couple of weeks. We got weeks. stopped last night. Right. Got a rat stop stop like, so. Come out like we really doing something wrong. But right. if it's a public right. phone, come we can't use a public phone. We the public. Straight BK. We just Crips in the Straight BK. Straight BK. All day. All day. Ain't gonna stop. Even on my T.J. on birthday. Four trade. <laughs> Grape Street. Five deuces. Baby, family, baby. It's not gonna change nothing. It's making it worse. It's not gonna change nothing. It's making it worse. It's making it worse. It ain't gonna change nothing. It can't change. It can't quit. Once we in, we in. Ain't gonna stop. To the cash. Can I ask you more questions? Then get some shots of us. Hold on, chill out, spread out. Spread out like we were standing when they first came up. 13 shots or something. Um, just kind of, it's just the like TV one. lingo. It's just the, um, you know, kind of to show that we were here and we were talking to you. And then we want to get some pictures of you over there. Basically, what y'all want to know. Hold on, basically what y'all want to know is the zero tolerance going to help. That's what y'all want to know? I think you No good. No way. What it's gonna do, and I won't get this on the camera. What it's gonna do, make it worse. It's making it worse. That's what it's doing. It's not helping none. It's making it worse. It's making us bang harder. It's making us bang harder. They not gonna stop, we not gonna stop. You don't know what them suckers gonna do, but I know we ain't gonna stop. Yeah. We're talking about the road. Yeah. This ain't, ain't, no, ain't no day for train. I know, John, I'm in trouble. So, just, anyway, just so I know, how, the signs are basically your way of establishing what's going on. And give them love. And that's love, baby. Now, someone that was a blood monster, we're going to get smoked. Yeah, we hit him up. We're going to hit him up. We're going to hit him up with this. Then we're really going to hit him up. Then we're going to hit him up like this. We're going to hit him up like this. Yeah. I got some ones in my hand. I got some ones in my hand.
years. I only shoot. I tell you, I'm still on the dive. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope that, you know, y'all don't think this all does. Yeah, it's bigger than this. Baby. It's hundreds, though. Let them go. It, it, it's way bigger than this. It's way bigger than this. This ain't all of them. Oh, right. This is just a few. It's just a few. Grape Street. Grape Street. C to the heart, bro. That's OGC looks ah. right there. 103rd Grape Street. Y'all ever heard of OG? <laughs> no, they got the leaders up there. Uh, ain't no, OG. It ain't no leaders. Ain't no, it's, it's OG. OG. Yeah. OG. Yeah. Original, Me. original. Okay, I got you. OG. Yeah. You earn your game straight. Yeah. This right here, my homeboy, Lil' Rock. He locked up right now. Throwing that BK up. Boy. Throwing that, throwing that blood killer up. Blood killer. You see it on This right here is me. Hot sauce. Carlos. It's so real. Now it's Boots. This is my homeboy Boots right there. Right there. Boots, let him get a picture of you, cuz. This is Boots right here. Boots right here. This is my, this is my local. Y'all know about Boots. Y'all know about Boots. Y'all know about me. This is the egg right here. This is the egg right now. This is the egg. The egg. This is the egg right now. Call him AC. Aggravated Cricket. That's him. Have you had anybody killed him? AG, baby. No, that's the people. Safe. I don't know. Safe. Take him over here. Do you do something on a wall? Will we be telling that? Y'all come back home. Y'all come back here. Let me tell you what happened. I'm going to tell you what happened. I'm going to tell you what happened. Real. It wasn't like this. Some slobs, some blood, some suckers. That's what we call them. They come. They come and exit this out. Before the little, before the little old war started. Before the little old war started, they came and exit this out. So we removed it. That's why it's called slide removal. See right there? We removed that by putting blue X's up there, right? This ain't all. There's just a few of them. We got all the sets over here. Right here. Oh, back here, man. It's all back here. It's all back here. What's four by three? Four trays. That's them. That's a set. What else? Five dudes right here. Five dudes. Right here. That's five dudes right there. Back here, man. It's Grape Street. Get a picture of it. 103rd. 103rd. That's Grape Street. 103rd right there. You got the Hoovers. You got the four trays. You got the Duke. You got the Grape Street. You got the Grape Street. Four tray all day. Burger King. Burger King. Uh, Burger King. Uh, Burger King. Burger King. You wanna know what BK is? BK is a blood killer. 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 Blood Right there. Right here. Let him read this. Let him read this here. Gangster family. See that? You read that? Yeah. Fuck a slob. Cuz. Everybody's with the pants, man. It's us. Everyday banging. It's us. It's our life. Everyday banging. Everyday banging. Everyday banging. Everyday banging. Everyday banging. Don't get no funner than this here. Don't get. That's what it is. Say, give some shout out. Right here. Crip or die. Crip or die. We're going to crip till we die. Can't nobody shout, stop shout, us. Shout. Can't nobody oh, stop us. Home. Crip or die. Can't nobody stop us. That's nobody. That's the sign right there. Crip or nobody. die. Nobody. Penitentiary. None of that. Georgetown Hoyas. What's yeah. that mean? Who was on your ass? Who was on your ass? Who was on your ass? What that for? He got a crib hat on. The police back there. Let me hit that square. The police back there got a crib hat on. Get a picture of it. I want everybody to know that it's for real in Texas. It's for real in Fort Worth, Texas. Ain't it's no for real. Ain't no more all that. It ain't real Crips down here. It ain't no real gangs down here. It's for real. And y'all should see that by now. It's for real. I say what's up to my brother, Lid Rank, nigga. He's up in the house, cool. Rest in peace. But a nigga still remember him. Nigga ain't gonna never forget about him. Down here in his heart, cool. He just raised. He just raised.
What's the purpose behind Zero Tolerance? Uh, the purpose behind Zero Tolerance is uh, to get some of the gang members off of the streets. Uh, follow the gang members around, or people that we know that are gang members. If they commit some type of violation, then we're going to go ahead and force, enforce the law to the letter of its full extent. Uh, if that's from cash bonding them on a the ticket and putting them in jail and putting their cars in the pound, uh, then that's what we're going to have to do because we're having too many uh, gang-related shootings and so forth where innocent people are also getting hurt in the middle of this. What's the goal of it I and mean, what do you hope to accomplish? What we hope to accomplish is to get some of the gang members uh, to calm down uh, with some of the gang banging uh, to where they don't just jump up so quick, grab a gun, go to the other guy's house and start shooting up his house, riding up and down the street, taking a shot at somebody, endangering innocent citizens as well as the people that they're out to kill. So. Is it working? We feel it's working to an extent. Uh, right now, uh, it's more of a cat and mouse game. Uh, to where the gang members, if they see us out on the street, they are dropping their bandanas and their guns and so forth and going back in the houses and uh, waiting and so forth until we're off the streets. Obviously, we can't stay on the streets for 24 hours a day with the no tolerance, but they're kind of scooting from one area to the next when they see us coming. So it's not the cure-all, but it's... No, most definitely not. Uh, I feel a cure-all is going to have to be uh, intervention and uh, prevention as well as enforcement. But it's the violence you're aiming at? Most definitely. Right now we're trying to stop some of the violence because we're having too many innocent people and too many kids getting caught up in this uh, so-called gang-banging life. How bad was it? How bad was it in these neighborhoods that, that caused you to want to crack down and say we got to stop this? Uh, well, it's bad enough for uh, our young innocent kids. Uh, point of example, we had a seven-year-old kid that got caught up in a crossfire of a drive-by shooting uh, that was killed. Uh, we had one young man that was sitting on the hood of his vehicle and some kid came by and shot him simply because he was wearing a different color. Uh, you know, when you have situations like that happen, then it's getting pretty bad in your neighborhood. And mothers and kids, I mean, it was just dangerous for people to be out? Most definitely. What's been the reaction from the gangs to it, in your estimation? The gangs have had uh, all type of reactions. Uh, the majority of them feel that we're only out to harass them and uh, to pick on them simply because they are in a gang. Uh, some of the gang members actually think it's a good idea because they're actually being hunted by other gangs and it gives them a little bit of relief knowing that we're out there on the street making sure nobody's going to drive by their house and shoot their house up. A lot of people would say, God, you know, I, Fort Worth here is just kind of middle America and it's got this gang problem. Well, I mean, you have to look at Fort Worth, you know, for what it really is. I mean, Fort Worth is a, is a major city. and. Uh, with its crime rate per capita, it ranks up there as one of the top cities. People just sick of the gangs and everything that goes with them? I think a lot of people are just getting fed up with it, you know, because it's touching so many of the young kids and we're starting not to see a future, you know, a shot for the future for our young kids. Was, did the police just say, we can't let this go on, we can't have this summer be this way? Uh, most definitely. Uh, the police department is uh, always been out there trying to stop some of the gang violence, but when it escalated up, then we had to turn up our force uh, to go right along with it instead of staying on one level and letting them go over the top of us. So it's not just really a war between the gangs? No, nah, not at all. So basically match force with force? Match force with force. I think also the community is going to have to get involved with this thing uh, because it see it's happening out in the communities and if the citizens in the community don't want it, the police department don't want it, then I'm pretty sure we can get some of this stuff stopped. Actually we talked to a lot of people, even people who were getting tickets at the roadblock and they supported right. it. Uh, have you ever seen this much citizen support for a police action before? Uh, to be honest with you, I really haven't. I think the community is finally fed up on this thing because a lot of innocent people are getting hurt and killed and caught up in this. We have uh, people in houses that are scared to even come out you know, and walk around the block because they're scared some gang member is going to assault them or shoot them or something. What's zero tolerance mean? What's a basic, when you call it zero tolerance, what message are you sending out? Uh, zero tolerance means that if we catch you violating any law 
or, or breaking any city ordinance, we're going to force it to the full letter of the law, what it calls for. We're not going to pat you on the hand and uh, send you home or give you a lecture and saying, please don't do this. You know, if we catch you breaking the law, then we're going to go ahead and enforce it. Now, there's been a side effect of this. It's all of a sudden not so popular to be a gang member. Most definitely. Uh, we have a lot of kids out on the streets now that uh, won't admit to being a gang member because they're scared that if they're stopped for breaking the law and they admit to being a gang member, that the law is going to be enforced to the full letter on Did you expect that to happen too? Uh, to be honest with you, I figured most of the gang members would stick with their gang uh, names and so forth because they take so much pride in it. But we have actually seen entire gang members just disclaim their gang totally. And what effect is, does that have? Is that a, a side benefit of it all or does it really do anything? I think it's a pretty good effect because uh, here these same gang members have been telling the younger kids in the neighborhood, you know, they'll always be in this gang. Nobody will make them change their mind. But when they actually see the police department talking to them or stopping them, then these guys are denying their gang affiliation. So it's almost lying to these little kids out on the street when they look at them. Hey, you're really not that bad, you know, that you claim you are. So the whole idea is just to make it uncomfortable to be a gang member, basically? Well, to, to make it uncomfortable to involve yourselves in organized crime. You know, that's what our gangs are. A group of individuals that come together and involve themselves in organized crime or criminal activity. If they were all just hanging out together, uh, wearing blue rags or, or red rags or whatever, we wouldn't have a problem with them. But once they start involving themselves in criminal activity, that's where we get involved. Okay, great. Is this the best police can do? No, I really don't believe it is. Uh, uh, you know, I believe that we're going to have to do more intervention programs. I believe we're going to have to do more programs involving the citizens of our community. And then I think we'll be up to our best. But it's always room for improvement no matter what you do in law enforcement. Uh, yeah. Two shot or? Yeah. Okay. That's all right. We're just going to get a shot of us standing. Okay, we're all right, you said, so you need me talking? Yeah. This is just a shot just to say we, we said that we came here and talked to you and all that. Um, do you have an estimate on just how many gang members you, you think there are in, in Fort Worth? We have a little over 3,000 gang members in the city of Fort Worth. Uh, that doesn't mean all 3,000 are active. Right. Out of the active list, say about 1,500. So when I say active, our active list shows the gang members that have gotten into some type of criminal activity within a two-year period. The ones that have been stagnant within that two-year period, we put them on an inactive list. Now, we're basically talking about, what, a 10-square-mile area, East Fort Worth is the main target area. Is that about the size of it? Pretty much, but the thing about our gangs is that they're all mobile, so we can have a right. gang from Fort Worth, I mean, I mean, on the east side of Fort Worth, going to the west side, the south side. So gang violence is throughout the city, and not just throughout the city, it's spread throughout Tarrant County also. About what's the population of East Fort Worth, the main area that you see that's been kind of hit hard? Uh, if I if I took a uh, guess at it, you know, it'd truly be a guess. Okay. I don't, I don't even All know. right. Oh,